Raider Nation, what's going on, man? KHO82, I'm back at y'all. And I suppose I did a 500 subscriber video contest type giveaway type thing like last week. But of course, as always, I get busy. And I'm going to do it right now. Just got finished watching the playoff games, as we know. Um, the Broncos and the 49ers both won, which Raider fans out there in Oakland can't stand San Francisco. And, you know, Raider fans in general, because the Broncos, like the division rival, can't stand the Broncos. Me personally, I, I'd rather for I, my most hated team in the division is the Chargers. Phillip Rivers and LT killed us for years, and I just can't stand them. So I, I had no problem. And Peyton Manning just a, such a good dude, man. I had no problem with Denver winning. Anyway, they ain't about the Raiders. Let's keep it moving. 500 subscriber contest. This is how I'm going to do it. All right, if you want in, okay, I'm sure I'm give away. The Raiders, the Raiders hard hat. I'm dropping stuff all over the place. The Rod, uh, what is it? Yeah, the Rod Street autograph rookie card. That's kind of going up in value a little bit, man. The better he get, the more the more um, value you get. I can't really get it to show the autograph. And the, um, the pair of Raiders gloves. That's the five subscribers. To get that, all you got to do is tell me who my favorite three Raiders on the team. Um, videos or... Uh, me talking to give you an idea of what I like. And if you could tell me my three favorite Raiders, comment below. Um, and everybody get it right. I do a little, um, like a random type thing. And whoever win, win. Nobody gets it right. What I do is my next video, I say nobody got my favorite three. And I add something else to it and just ask another question about the Raiders. I feel like it's easier, more funner than do it that way. So who's my favorite three Raiders on the team this year? Whoever answered right, get the stuff. Uh, also, for 500 subscribers, sometimes you want to take time. To, that I'm going to thank y'all for subscribing. And there's a few guys. I hate the name, guys, because I'm going to miss somebody. And I apologize because, you know, when you get, I get like 400 views on my video sometimes, three to 400 views, and people watching. And that's really what I want. You know what I'm saying? But a lot of people comment. And there's a lot of guys, man, who, who four guys in general, who I know has been commenting like on every video I do. And for one, is on my homeboy Nick T from Twitter. I don't know Nick T. I know he stay out there in Oakland because he a Golden State fan and uh, well stay near Oakland and he a Raider fan. And um, I talked to him on talked to him on Twitter. He been commenting my video since the beginning. Nick T the type of person when we lose, man, he get on Twitter and talk shit to all the Raiders. And uh, half time they deserve that shit, man. They don't play like garbage. But anyway, shout out to you, man. Um, you know what I'm saying? You always look at my videos, comment. Baby Blue Legend, you always comment on everybody's videos that create on the on the Raider Nation, man. Shout out to you. I always give you a shout out, man, because you got good insight to me and me and you agree on some things. I mean, sometimes we might disagree, but the debate is there. It's conversation friendly debate. It's the way I like it. Nobody getting mad or no shit like that. Um, my boy Josh Hibbert from Twitter. Man, that's that's my guy, man. He he he, he Matt McGloin guy. I'm a Terrell Pryor guy, but we come together because we Raider fans and and uh stick together. And Dean Barraza from from Twitter. You know who you are, man. I think I spelled your name right. Dude is a passionate, passionate Raider fan. I know he's a Laker fan, too. You can see him tweeting about sports all the time. And they like the four guys that stuck out to me, man. If I miss you and you comment on my videos, I apologize. Don't get mad at me. Don't unsubscribe. Um, but they the four guys that stood out to me, man. I appreciate everybody. But those four, like I said, they most of them, been, when I started on Twitter, they was the um, Barraza, D. Barraza, and Josh Hibbert. They was there. And then when I first started the channel, my first video when I was playing a game of Madden and telling the people that I was going to make the channel, um... Uh, Baby Blue Legend and Nick T, they was they was there commenting on those videos. So, and now let's talk about some Raiders. Uh, we re-signed uh, what's the coach name? What is the coach name? Us uh, Ronald from the, the one he was the head coach of the Dolphins. We re-signed him. Good, it was a good good re-signing. Go get him his two year deal. Um, I, I read somebody tweet the other day. You got to keep him on the staff because if Dennis Allen started off zero six, he the guy that's gonna take the head coaching uh, job, which is pretty funny to me, man. But I'm glad we re-signed him. And something happened a while ago that I actually got from, I didn't know about it until somebody commented on it. On my last video, the Raiders signed Trent Edwards. What the fuck is we signing Trent Edwards for, man? I'm like, that is a complete waste of fucking signing, man. I, that shit pissing me off. I he had no shot of making the team. If he make the team, he going to piss me off. Rich, Trent, if you a Raider fan, you remember Trent Edwards playing for, for Buffalo. And he torched, <coughs> excuse me, he torched us. In the second half, if we got that Trent Edwards, I know somebody know what I'm talking about. It was, it was years back when we played for Buffalo. I want to say it was his rookie season. That some bitch got hot, and we couldn't stop him. Yeah, we had a shitty defense, but actually, I think that was on um, Rod Ryan's defense that he did that against. I could be wrong, but I think I think it was Rod Ryan's defense. He torched him, man. That dude got hot. If we had that Trent Edwards, I'd be happy. But no, we getting the one that's some shit. So the hell with the Trent Edwards signing. Um, 
I was looking at playoff. I'm, not, I'm just going through different things. I was looking at playoff football, and the more and more I look at playoff football, seeing these teams in, the more and more I say the Raiders need to draft a quarterback, man. It's time for us to get this franchise QB. You know what I'm saying? No trying to sign. I mean, if you're going to sign, no trying to sign Vic. Let, let McGloin be the backup. Um, or probably whoever they want, you know what I'm saying, more fit. But we got to draft a quarterback, man, and build this dude, man. And, and let me explain real quick. Look at the teams that was playing today. All right, let's start with the Chargers. The Chargers didn't make the playoffs last year. Why they didn't make the playoffs last year? Because Phillip Rivers was ass last year. He turned his whole season around. I mean, he, he get back to right. Phillip Rivers football playing good. Chargers in the playoffs. Uh, to go to the Chiefs, why they didn't make the playoffs last year? Why were they 2-14? and 14? No quarterback play. The quarterback play was atrocious. Bring in Alex Smith. He's not the greatest, but his numbers was real good. Hey, what they was 12 and 4, 11 and 5. They in the playoffs. Um, the Broncos, Peyton Manning, he the best. I mean, playoffs. Tom Brady. Every year the Patriots win 10 games. They in the playoffs. Cam Newton. Last year he played like garbage. This year he played real good football. Where he find himself at in the playoffs. <clears throat> um, Russell Wilson playing good football for Seattle when they finally got a quarterback to go with that defense and that home crowd. They find themselves in the playoffs, man. I know some good quarterbacks that don't make the playoffs, but very rarely do you find a, a, a shitty quarterback being in the playoffs. Um, another example, the Eagles from last week. Um, they lost last week, but Vic was playing like garbage. Foles had a good season. Bam, they in the playoffs. It's just it's the way I see it, man. It starts with the quarterback position, man. And I really, really want the Raiders to draft a quarterback. And, um, Number five, man, I, I was talking to another guy on Twitter the other day. He was like, we get that dude Bortles from UCF. He would be disappointed. I probably would, too, until I look at more. I've been looking at tape on him, trying to like him just in case we get him. But we got to go quarterback, man. If you think we got to go something else, leave in the description. Why? Because I just see, like, they quarterback is the position, man. It's just the premium position, man. It's just... You got to go quarterback, man. The 49ers had that dominant defense when Singletary was there. But Alex Smith was playing like garbage. When they put in Harbaugh, he turned Alex Smith around. They went to the playoffs instantly, man. Like, like you can't come. You get Dennis Allen one year. He got to get a quarterback. It's sad that he got to get a rookie quarterback because I don't know no Andrew Luck's coming out there. And if you know me, you know I love Andrew Luck. I don't know no Andrew Luck's coming out the draft. But, we, it's, man, we got to take a damn quarterback. And, um... That's what it is, man. So, yeah, that's the best I want to talk about today, man. Just a few things, man. My 500 subscriber contest. Again, I appreciate everybody for subscribing. I named the four guys I wanted to talk about, man. I appreciate it. Um, Oh, yeah, something else I'm thinking about doing to my channel is I got plenty of stuff. Like I said, for Raider stuff. And, like, when you order for the store, a lot of times you got to get six, eight or something. to Like, six or eight or one team to get it. And, like I said, my area, I like to get Raider stuff for myself. So, my area, um... Don't do not do big, uh, it ain't a whole lot of Raider fans. So a lot of times the stuff sits, sit, sit, and I had to put it on clearance to get to, like get it off, man, or come put it on eBay or something. So, I put, you know, I, I have no problem, like, giving it to my subscribers, man, and, um, you know, guys that want it. So I was thinking about doing was maybe hooking up with Google Plus and do, like, a podcast type thing where I do some Raider trivia with some one of my subscribers who want to do it. And, um... And we talk about the Raiders and then do some trivia questions to give away surprises or whatever like that. I love, I love, I love sports trivia, man. I, I absolutely love it. I mean, I see one thing. I love trivia and I love I'm a transaction junkie, man. So the off season is my time. I got plenty of time on my hands. So that's something I want to do is be able to hook up with Google Plus and do like a sports trivia type thing, man, with uh, fellow Raider fans. But anyway, man, I'm about to hit the 10 minute mark already. That shit was fast. Appreciate y'all for subscribing again. My top three Raiders from this team. From this year's team, who was my favorite three? And my videos, if you know me, if you hear me talk, should get you all the clues you need. Put them down below, man. I appreciate y'all, man. Peace. Oh, yeah, it's only one nation, man. That's Raider Nation.